Tonight, documented immigrants in Northwest Florida are raising concerns about a new state immigration law. They say they're afraid for their friends and family who are not documented. As WKRG News 5's Cody Long reports, many of them are rushing to other states because they're afraid they'll be sent back to their dangerous home countries. We are all humans and we need help. Lucy Trejo is a DACA recipient. She came to America from Mexico. She's speaking out against SB 1718 for her friends and family who will be impacted. If I didn't have no documents, I would be going back to being exposed to the cartels, to being killed, to worst, to be harvest of my organs, to be sold in the black market. She was one of several people who addressed the Escambia County Commission Thursday night. I would like to give our community an opportunity to stand so you can see who they are. Familia? Grace McCaffrey says immigrants are the ones to thank for the building they're standing in. She says the new law will hurt the economy and the county commissioners should care about the local ramifications. We need help speaking to our legislators. Uh, I know that you guys don't necessarily work with them every day, but you know who they are and you know how they operate and you can speak on our behalf. The new law will target undocumented immigrants so they cannot get a state issued driver's license and employers with more than 25 employees will have to reveal their workers immigration status. I have taken a lot of people out of state because they're scared. The law takes effect July 1st. In Pensacola, Cody Long, WKRG News 5.